Salmon farming has been shown to have positive economic effect on rural communities, but can also have significant negative consequences for the environment. Sea lice infestation is the biggest problem of the salmon industry, with serious negative impacts on animal welfare and the economic outcome. The industry has battled sea lice outbreaks with medicines and bath treatments that are potentially harmful for the fish and the environment. The sea lice populations are now becoming immune to many of these treatments, and the industry is thus implementing the use of cleaner fish, such as lumpfish, to graze sea lice from farmed salmon. Sea lice infestation has been a serious problem for salmon farming in the Faroe Islands. In 2014, the Marine and Freshwater Research Institute in Iceland began a research and development project on the production of lumpfish juveniles for the Faroese farming company Hiddenfjord. Over 300,000 lumpfish juveniles were produced this first season and transported to the Faroe Islands for direct deployment as cleaner fish in the salmon pens. The lumpfish soon started grazing down the sea lice and the lice numbers began to drop dramatically. This marked a true turning point in the battle against sea lice in the Faroe Islands. The Icelandic Institute has since been delivering about 300,000 lumpfish each year to farming companies in the Faroe Islands and also in Iceland. In Iceland, sea lice infestation has been a problem for salmon farming on the West Fjords, but not yet on the East Fjords, where the sea temperatures are lower. The Icelandic Institute has, from the beginning of this project, worked closely with Benchmark Genetics in Iceland, which now delivers up to 3 million lumpfish per year. During this period, specific vaccines and speciality feeds have been developed for lumpfish, and as a result, the quality of the delivered lumpfish is steadily improving. The transport methods for delivering live lumpfish have also been developed, and nowadays the lumpfish are delivered to the pharaohs in specialised containers and by transport boats to the Icelandic Westfjords. The salmon farmers have also developed purpose-designed shelters and feeding methods, leading to increased survival and welfare of the lumpfish. In view of the predicted expansion of salmon farming in Iceland, the demand for lumpfish may be expected to increase over the coming years. There are many important research and development challenges still facing this industry. The deployment of lumpfish in salmon farming is an example of successful biological control of the sea lice problem in good harmony with nature. Thank you.